Okay, and we're back for the the back nine here on the 11s. First round I've ever played. Um, this back nine does not go as well as the front nine, I can tell you that. Nicely played. All right, second shot on the 10th. I don't like that water there. And I know that if I hit it that long, I'm pretty sure I'm going to end up in the water. So I bring it back a little bit. I'm still way below the learning curve here. And again, I'm using the three click system, which I think a lot of people frown on, but um, the mouse system just didn't work for me. Ooh, see, that's what I was afraid of. Oh, well, that's no good. At least it didn't go in the water. I need to go back into the Don't practice down range. On yourself, coming off a string of uh, three bogeys in a row, but I think you can turn things around here. And figure out how to make it stop, which I'm pretty sure I can do. Uh, this should be an alright shot, I think. Again, this is my first round. I'm still getting the feel of it. This one's looking good. Again, too long. i got to learn how to make the ball stop. Nicely done. Back in the fairway. I like it. Let's, uh, let's just drop one next to the pin next shot. So I'm on a series of bogeys here. Not nearly strong enough. 13 feet left. Another thing I figured out about putting was that if you push the R key, it shows you where the ball is going to go. I didn't do that in this round at all. I don't know how I feel about that. And I'm going to miss quite a few putts. Oh, just right by the hole. Nothing you can do now to just uh, pop in the bogey and we'll move on. So and another we'll bogey. We'll move into the next. And that'll leave you at three over for the day. Uh, I'm still and not up considering it's 11. too bad for my first round. Hmm. Again, I think I have to learn how to make the ball stop. I know there's a way to do it. This is my first practice round. I'm just getting a feel for the game. Did hit that entirely really too well. Actually, not bad. Nice approach. Let's see how you do with this 13 foot putt. Oh, my struggle with the putting. A little bit that way. Let's just Slight break there. This one's on a good line. Mm. Well, that's about as good as I can do. <laughs> a little Just, bit too uh, strong. Yeah, a little too much on there. Okay, par putt coming up. Didn't look at the up or down, which I should have. Oh, and again, I miss it. So when you three putt, you're not going to get very far. All right, a little tap putt here. So another bogey. And as that putt drops, let's take a peek at the scorecard. Four over par for the day. So I'm staying consistent with my bogeys. Coming at you. Oh, pretty good shot. Just try to hit it as best I can. Not too bad. Another thing I gotta start paying attention to is the wind. And I know equipment will get better too, and I probably can get some balls that have better That'll do. Better grip. Setting up about 115 yards out. And there's a lot of uh, up and down on that green though. Let's see what this looks like. Well I think this will find the surface. Mm, yeah, I'm a little too far. Approach shot worked out just fine, and from 23 feet away.
Man, this this green is all over the place. Definitely should have went more to the left, I think. But it doesn't seem like it's going to break that much, but I don't know. I think it does break pretty bad. Yeah, look at that. Way, way off. Again, I didn't know about the R key yet. Yeah, I don't know if there's a way you can limit that. that I don't think I want to use it every and time. For the par. Can I make a par? Looks fairly flat. Not a lot of break, from what I can tell. So I'm gonna go a little bit that way. Going towards that hole. Yeah, still oh. not enough. All right, good luck here. This one's for bogey. So really, I've had a couple pars there that got away from me because I can't putt. And you're currently sitting at five over. So five over. Now in a long par four. Um, again, this is my first round, so I know it will get harder. I'm not sure what I'm going to do after this round. I might play another couple practice rounds and maybe some harder courses. Um, start on my career and do the. I think this one will play. Ooh, barely. Go to the Q school. Also, um, season pass just ended, and I think there's another season pass starting. Okay, about. So I'm probably gonna wait till that season pass starts to, to get here. serious about this. Hmm. Maybe I should back off. I don't know. That's about as good a shot as you're gonna make. But this one's some going reason, right. Doesn't hit the green. That's okay. No I worries. Think it was we'll the wind. I wasn't paying enough. attention to the wind. And this is our third shot. Again for a birdie. Let's see if I can put it in. Oh, not strong enough. Nice tempo on that chip. Just nice and easy. Well done. This putt's about four feet. Surely I can make this for a par. Ooh. Just nice. Okay, so I broke the string of bogeys. Six in a row. Five over par currently. Let's see what happens here on number 14. So I should if I get a good shot, should get that one up here. Hmm, except I didn't have a good shot. Still gonna get up on there though. And I know these greens are really flat. And this putt is way out there. Best of luck. Can you get a birdie? I doubt it. Hmm. Some going that way, some going that way. I think I'm just going to hit it, see what happens. Oh, man. I did not see that break. And this is your look at par. Breaking down. It could be a good oh, one. Oh, still not enough. Oh, rolled right by. Still definitely have trouble with putting. About six After feet After I played to go this round, here. I went to the putting green and practiced quite a bit of putting. Looking good. Oh. Oh no, it's right down. And for the double. So now I'm making double bogeys. All right, now let's rip out the scorecard. See what that's saying. And that's seven over par currently. Definitely okay, have to work on putting. Par I think I'm gonna. Uh, season seven is up. I think it's 19 bucks. Probably gonna give it a go. Uh, I see myself playing this game for at least a season.
any beginners out there that want to play around with me drop me a note I'm definitely beginner damn well that's too bad not stay on the green second shot here on the 15th man look at that uh, anybody out there as a beginner like me wants to play around drop me a note Oh, come on, come on. Oh. That was pretty dialed in, especially considering hitting from the rough. All right, you've got about six feet here. Come on, can I make a birdie? It would be nice to make a birdie. This putt's tracking. Yes. And nicely done. That putt will drop on in there for birdie. So I have gotten three birdies. All right, that's, that's six not the over end of the day. world. Let's see what happens here on the 16th. Mm, nice long shot. I just hit it good. Should be all right. A little bit of wind. But I did not hit it good. Yeah, that'll play. Okay, setting up here about 140 to the pin. 40, 142, I think I should back off, but I don't probably. And I didn't hit it real well. I'm going to stay out of the sand. Yeah, way, way, way too deep. But it does kind of circle back down and roll down, so that's not bad. Yeah, that'll work. I got a little bit of luck there. Okay, this putt can uh, take you down a five over. Hmm, 16 footer. Doesn't look like there's a lot of break. Just a little bit that way. See what happens. Didn't hit it. Let's see. Ah, went right by. Didn't hit it go. real well. Par putt. So I can stay at par, and that'll be all right. If I can get it in. Okay, well putt. Now let's move on. And six over par on the round. Here we go. Hole number 17, ready to go. Okay, I'm hanging at plus six. I'll take that for the first round. Hmm, I don't like this. I'm just going to back off, try to hit the middle of the green. I think if I get too far though, it's going to roll downhill. Look at that, the red was a pretty good hill. Well, that's a pretty good shot. Hmm. Mm, not bad. I can just keep it from rolling. Oh, it's going to circle back towards the pin. All right, I'll take that. Again, got a little lucky. Yeah, that's going to work for you. I'm liking that. This one's eight. Feet away. Let's see. A little bit that way. This one's tracking. And again, I miss it. Shouldn't miss eight this feet. This one's for par. Maybe I can stay at uh, plus six. This putt's going. Nice. That's going to work. That's for par. Birdie and two pars. And how about after all that string of bogeys? So this is the last hole. We'll see what we can do. So hole number 18 is in front of us. Hmm. I think we just hit it. The wind's like one mile an hour. That's not too much trouble. That was a tee shot. Just spanked it. 300 off the tee is pretty good. 
We are about 140 yards out. So I hope you enjoy this round. I'm probably going to do a couple more practice rounds before I head to key school. Once the season pass starts, I think I'm going to buy it so I can get some cool looking stuff. So I back up on this shot a little bit. I think I should have went to the left a little bit because of the wind. I don't know. It's not a lot of wind. Actually, not too bad. Nice stroke. We're on the green. Okay, this can take you down to five over par. This is for birdie. Can I pull off a birdie on the last hole? Oh, yes, I can. Well, heading towards the hole. So thanks for watching. I uh, uh, hope you enjoy this series. I'll probably keep going. Have a great day. Steady Claudio out. Okay, as we head our separate ways, that's five over par for you. And with that, I say goodbye. And hopefully we'll see you again real soon.